everyone. I'm going to be going over tonight how I like to create a recipe. Uh, the recipe feature in FitPal is a little difficult to use. I don't prefer it. So I'm going to be using my snack number two down here. And I'm creating uh, a recipe for spaghetti tonight. So I'm going with beef. And I'm going to be using this one down here at the bottom. And I have 375 grams cooked meat. Again, I've already done the conversions. I'm going to go ahead and add that. And I'm going to be going to spaghetti. Cooked. And we're going up to 100 grams cooked here. And I know that's the correct data. I've actually used this data many times. I'm having three servings, or I'm making three servings, so I'm going to change the serving size to three. And then, marinara. And you would do this for any of your recipes, any of the ingredients in your recipes. You would do total gram value, and then divide the yield by the amount of servings. So, I'm going to go with the um, marinara great value organic, which is what I use most frequently. Changing it to three servings, I'm going to add that. Now I'm going to go back out here, and I'm just going to screen capture this. I'm going to be dividing these by three to get my macros for this meal. And then I'm actually going to save this as a meal. And when you get finished cooking it all, you'll put it all on the food scale, and you'll take all of the gram value in totality, You'll then divide it by three, and that's what you would dish out of the pot for yourself. 